Welcome everybody to this new TechExpress video. In this tutorial, we're going to be focusing into how we can actually change the color of the Buy It Now button. It's going to be really, really, really easy. So let's get started. So first of all, the things that what I'm going to be doing here today is to access your Shopify dashboard. I'm going to leave you guys a link down below in the description so you can all get started totally for free. Now that you have access to your Shopify, now that you have your very first stored, now that you have your store here, you can see that we have the actual Buy It Now button. Today, what I wanted to do is to change this color for something much more interesting. For example, let's say something like this exact color. So I'm going to go here into my Shopify dashboard. Once I'm here into my Shopify, locate your online store and go directly into themes. Inside themes, let's go to the next step, which is to go into the theme editor. I'm going to go here instead of customize, let's go for the three dots and let's go directly from edit the code. Now, you don't have to be worrying about all of this information because you don't have to do anything about cutting. I'm going to leave you guys a link down below in our description, guys, so you can have the actual code I'm going to be using today. And the actual code is the Buy It Now button color from pastebin.com. It's just as easy, guys, as copy this code and paste it to a specific location. So what I'm going to be doing here is to show you where is the exact place you paste this code. So first of all, make sure that you copy exactly everything here into this coding. I copy it with Ctrl C and now I'm going to go back here into my Shopify. Now here what you wanted to do is to focus into the left part and check out the actual folders. Now inside your folders look out for assets and inside assets go for base.cws. Now here it's going to be really really easy just go all your way down and here into all your way down what you want to do is to go into the last part and paste your code really really easy just as simple as that now how can i choose this specific color well if you copy this actual code that appears here or this one whatever both of them and you paste it into a new tab what's going to be happening here is going to be showing me a color picker so that means that i can just select this circle and move it where i wanted it to have the actual color in this case i wanted to look out for something like this a little bit more purple so i'm gonna go for this and let's say for example like this so once you find the right color you're aiming for this is the code generated for us so i copy it and now i go back here now as you see we have the background and the color the background stands for the background color of the button and the color stands for the color of your text. So in this case, I'm gonna be using the background color. So instead of having this code, I select this code and I paste the new code that I generated here. And now the second color, I'm gonna be using the same actual color scheme, but a little bit much more darker like this. So that means that I can now copy it and do exactly the same thing. Select the color section and replace it with a new color. So now I'm going to hit now into save. Once this has been successfully done, let's go for the last step, which is previewing your store. Let's go back into my store. Let's reload the page and see if the color has now changed it. As you should see now, it actually works really, really great. So in this case, I do have this hover section, this border that I can edit directly into the theme section. But this is how you can edit the actual coding element. If you want to not to see this border here, what you want to do is to not do it directly into the coding, but into the customizable section. So you can go here inside your products. Let's say, for example, that I'm interested into this one just to see the reference. I go directly into the coding. And as you can see now, we do have the actual typed of the colors. So what I want to do is to go directly into my theme settings. I go for buttons and here's my thickness. I can change the thickness from three to zero. And there we go. There's no thickness anymore. I go now into save and then we're actually good to go. In my case, I'm gonna go and leave it even into a little bit much more wider than that. So let's go here into save. I go back into my store, I reload my page, and we're actually good to go. So guys, there you have it. A really simple way to change your actual buy it now button without having to knowing absolutely anything about coding. 
Just in case you have any questions, you can leave it down below in the comment section. Once again, you have the link down below in the description so you can get started with your Shopify store and you have as well the actual coding uh, to copy it and paste it into your website. Thank you so much for watching the video, guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Hopefully, we can all see you onto a brand new video. See you soon.